Hi, today I would like to show you a useful feature on the Agilent U8031A triple output power supply. This feature allows you to preset the output sequence up to three levels from the front panel. In this demo, I will be doing a simple margin test on the Agilent handheld DMM using the U8031A power supply. We will test the operating condition with three battery levels, dead battery at 5 volts, nominal level at 7.2 volts and with fully charged battery at 9 volts. First press 1 to select output 1. Press display limit. The blinking V shows that we are at voltage limit setting. Turn the knob until the reading shows 5 volts. Press the voltage current button to set the current limit. Turn the knob until the display shows 0 0.5 amps. Turn on output 1 now. We need to save the voltage and current limit in the output on setting to memory. Press the memory button to enter memory mode. Press the memory button again to save it to M1. Now I will set the second output level to 7.2 volts. Repeat the same steps. Press display limit. Turn the knob until it reaches 7.2 volts. I will leave the current limit as it is. Press the memory button to enter memory mode. Now turn the knob slowly until you see M2 is blinking. Press memory to save the 7.2 volts to memory 2. Similarly, press display limit. Turn the knob until the voltage reaches 9 volts. Press the memory button. Turn the knob until the M3 is blinking. Press the memory button again to save 9 volts to memory 3. Now I would like to tell the power supply to output the voltage for a predefined interval of 5 seconds. Press delta T once. You will see the M1 indicator. Turn the knob until the display shows 5 seconds. Press and hold delta T to save the interval setting for M1. Repeat the step for memory 2. You can select memory 2 by pressing the memory button. Press and hold to save. Again press delta T. Press the memory button until you see M3. Make sure the display shows 5 seconds. Press and hold to save. Now turn off output 1. Connect output 1 terminal to the handheld DMM battery input. Press and hold memory out button for more than 5 seconds. This will activate the output sequencing and the output voltage will continue to loop until you stop it. You will notice the battery level indicator on the DMM as well.